Hi guys, Felix here from 4 Minutes or Less. Today I'm going to be reviewing my Buscemi shoes. These are in a tan brown. Uh, for those of you that don't know, these are modeled on the Birkin handbag here. So you're going to see it when we go into the clasp and key and the handle and that kind of stuff. This here, the logo at the front, you have the Buscemi made in Italy embossed, as well as on the side of the shoe in their classic gold. I think they have some in the silver. My favorite part here is the clasp for sure. It's uh, using sort of a magnetic mechanism, so when you turn it, it takes the magnet off or moves it, or I'm not sure how it works, but uh, it allows you to release it, turn it back, and then you can put the clasp back together, and that's what keeps your uh, the tongue of the shoe back. Keeping on that Birkin bag theme here, you have the key in the key holder slot, whatever you want to call it. It's a bit of a, a tricky thing for them to sew, but they've done a good job with it. The locks at the back, they will get a little bit beat up. I've had these shoes for about six months, I think, but I like them a lot, actually. Sticking with the Birkin, you have the handle at the back, and it's on there pretty solid, surprisingly. Um, I mean, I wouldn't play around with it too much, to be honest, but it's, it's solid for what it is. Uh, the stitching is perfect on the soles. I mean, not one out of place, and it's beautifully finished at the top. If you have a, a Louis Vuitton bag or an Hermes belt or something like that, they're using that same heat mechanism to seal up the leather. Uh, here in the inside, it's all padded and stamped with the Buscemi logo. Uh, mine are quite big. I have a size 12. Um, if you have a Zanotti's or something like that, they fit about the same as that. I'm a size 12 in those. Uh, to give you a comparison, I wear a size 10 in uh, Ferragamo and Gucci, so you have to size up if you're used to a wider shoe like I am. Uh, trying them on, they're just such comfortable shoes. I mean, more comfortable than I think any other sneaker I've worn. Um, I like these much better than Zanotti's. Just trying them on here. I tend to wear them with a very skinny jean. I have on uh, some blue Saint Laurent's here, and I just think that looks best for me. Overall, I mean, I'm extremely happy with them. I do have one small complaint, and it's really only minor. It's that the uh, the shoe bag it comes with, it's really only big enough for one shoe. Uh, I wear quite large shoes, so you, like, good luck getting a second one there and there. I had to get a different bag. Uh, my one other complaint, and once again, it's I don't even know if it's a complaint, but the lock on the back of the shoe, it definitely jingles around when you're walking and will make a noise. Anyways, overall, I mean, great shoes. I love them. I definitely would buy them again. Uh, don't forget to check back next week, guys, because I'm going to do the Bowman Biker Jeans review, so I'll see you then.